Hello Gemini, welcome to my channel and thank you for taking the time to watch this video. I'd also like to welcome Spirit into this reading and say thank you for the messages we are about to receive. This is a weekly reading for Gemini from the 7th to the 13th of October 2019. Please don't forget to watch your moon and rising sign for a more complete picture. If you'd like a personal reading, please go to my website, jessmart.co.uk and book a reading. I've put the decks that I'm using in the description box and I've put in links to Amazon and eBay. So please follow these links uh, to view or to buy the decks. And don't forget to watch my videos on Simple Energy Healing Remedies, my deck walkthrough series, as well as my videos on crystals and gemstones. You'll find those very interesting. So like, share, subscribe if these messages resonate with you. I'm starting off the general energy read and I will be using the Oracle of the Radiant Sun for that. And the first card is fulfillment. So uh, on the work front, it might be that you're going to be taking a job overseas. You got Saturn there with Sagittarius. And Sagittarius is ruled by Jupiter and this is the planet of expansion. You can see these ships coming in. So there's money coming in. And if you take this job overseas, it looks like it's going to be paying you pretty well. You've got this big bag of money over there. You need to stand up for yourself, speak your truth as well. You've got the sword in hand over there. Um, and, uh, you know, you need to be very bold in, in your moves as well. Now you've got secrets, so there are people that you're working with that are still keeping things from you or people around you keeping things from you, uh, but um, you know these things are going on behind the scenes that you have no knowledge of. There might be somebody around you um, that is um, dominating you quite a bit over there, not allowing you to expand. Maybe you do want to go overseas and something is preventing you or somebody is preventing you and this person is manipulating you. They might be using... Um, some kind of heavy-handed technique to keep you, uh, you know, in place. Uh, so there is that air of domination going on. And they're using it by, you know, uh, using secrets, maybe keeping secrets from you or using things against you and doing things behind your back, really. Now, in the past, you've got a quarrel. So there's somebody that you've been butting heads with, uh, somebody whom uh, you seem to have reached some kind of stalemate situation with. Uh, you've needed to use your intuition to get out of the situation. It's about thinking yourself out of the situation, um, you know, using your experience, uh, so to speak, to get out of whatever it is and going deep within yourself to get out of the situation. Now, going to the future, you've got the exaltation card. So money is coming in over there. You've got the moon sitting in Taurus over there. So there is going to be an improvement of your personal finances. You may need be negotiating a new career move or a new uh, deal as far as finances go. So maybe, um, you know, a, a new job offer coming in and you may need to negotiate how much you want to earn. And it might be some kind of job overseas as well. So those are the energies for that week. Seems to be all about the work. Okay, so I'm just going to draw some cards from the um, Everyday Enchantment Tarot. I have shuffled this deck. Okay, bottom of the deck, Queen of Coins. So this is about money, uh, being uh, handling resources, being very practical, and also it's about financial independence, and that is uh, maybe a promotion coming in for you over there, or this is a situation you are in. It seems like there's an offer that has come in over there from that King of Wands uh, in you know, for some kind of leadership position. So it seems like you've been offered a, a good paying job and it's a, a position of leadership as well. Um, and it seems like, uh, you know, this has come maybe out of the blues for you. Maybe you didn't have any knowledge that it was coming. You certainly have been through a lot with that strength card uh, there, uh, you know, and you've been hanging in there, but it looks like there's this new offer that's going to be coming in for you with that Queen of Cups. Sorry, the Queen of Coins. And, uh, you know, you'll be... You might even be working with children as well, since there's a lot of children. But you're certainly going to be hand, handling a lot of uh, um, resources. And it's going to bring in that coin. You can see this purse is full of coins there. Now, what's happening with you? You're making a brand new start. You're taking a leap of faith. You're going for it. And you are starting. 
Whatever it is you're going to be working on, it's like um, starting from scratch in a new position. So maybe you're setting up a business somewhere or you're setting up something uh, in another country maybe. Um, you're taking uh, that risk, you're going to go for it and you're starting afresh. And with that magician card, there's a lot of communication, there's a lot of networking coming in and a lot of hard work. But you have the skills and talents and you're very unique for that. Good communication skills um, and um, you know, you'll be able to make this garden grow if if you like and it's starting afresh from something uh, and putting in a lot of effort and energy into it so you're going to be pretty busy multitasking pretty soon it looks like there was some kind of legal issue that you were uh, involved in um, you know there may have been uh, um, you know a legal case that you were involved in and you were uh, you can see these two people fighting with each other so there seems to have been some kind of drama that happened over there and you, there doesn't seem to have been a settlement uh, or a, something was not decided you, uh, maybe you'll have to call in a mediator or they might have this case might have been uh, taken to court uh, you've got the page of wands over here and you've received uh, news pretty quickly um, recently um, where you've needed to act pretty quickly on that. So maybe there's a new job offer that has come in and you've needed to make um, quick decisions. This might be even about quick decisions about going overseas. He's jumping over this pond. It could be that you needed to make a quick decision about even leaving or moving on. But news has definitely come in about maybe a new job offer coming in over there. And it's certainly... Whatever information is coming, suddenly thrown a lot of light on that situation. So maybe this could have been this case being resolved pretty quickly with the light, new light being shed on it. Or it be, could be that, uh, uh, you know, you've had to make a decision about getting a new job pretty quickly. You've got uh, the three of blades. So you feel very, very upset about what has happened. Uh, whatever this fight or whatever this decision was, maybe it didn't go quite in your favor over there. You're pretty upset about something. You feel very let down, very betrayed as well. And feeling very, very lonely uh, um, too. You've worked pretty hard at this job or hard at this situation. And there's a heartbreak going on over there. You're very, very upset about things. So maybe that court case or whatever that justice uh, uh, decision was was did not go in your favor and it's upset you quite a lot you got the seven of coins over here so feeling as though you've invested in something and it didn't pay off but you're also thinking about you know where you can invest your talents in you're looking for a new job it seems and you're considering a lot of options as well and you're trying to find out the one that pays the best uh, with the seven of uh, coins there's somebody around you that's going to be giving you some advice as well so it's good to listen to that as well uh, so it, it looks like you know you're considering all your options you've got the eight of cups over here so a need for you to walk away from the situation so whatever has happened uh, it's no use crying over it it's finished and done with and it's time for you to now heal so you need to leave it the door is open for you your path is clear you will get going uh, but you need to leave behind the situation it cannot be remedied you need to let go of it and move on you got the six of cups it looks like there's an offer coming in for you there and it's going to be something really nice maybe you've worked with the people these people before uh, but it's going to be something that's very satisfactory for you and also um, you might be uh, you know in a leadership position over here it's something really brand new you're working with a new team of people and it's some you know people that you're going to be getting along with quite a bit uh, quite well You've got the Knight of Coins over here, so you are focused on that work. You just want to get things done. You want the money to come in, and you're willing to work hard for it with that Knight of Coins. You're worried, uh, you know, that uh, you're worried about a job, really. But it looks like things are, are you know, going to, to go in your way, in your favor. So you are looking for a job. You are worried that you won't get one. You've got the Hierophant card over here, the Seven of Cups, and the Nine of Blades. So the Hierophant um, is about um, maybe getting some... Um, advice from somebody uh, you might be even taking on a, t a role as a teacher with that Hierophant card over here um, you know Hierophant deals with institutions so you could be um, you know planning on doing some further study or further training but this could also be that you have uh, you need to do some research and find out exactly what you want to do next your next move like I said you could be thinking about doing some further learning or you could be even taking on that role as a teacher as well Maybe this is what this new job entails. You've got the Seven of Cups. There's a lot of options available for you, and you're not quite sure what to do next. Whatever this work is, it's very detailed work that you actually do, and uh, it's a very specialist kind of field. So maybe, you know, getting a job is a bit difficult at the moment. You're certainly considering all your options and looking at your coin very, very carefully over there, giving it a lot of thought. And with that Seven of Cups, you're a bit confused as to what to do next, and it's stressing you out with that Nine of Blades. So you are um, not sleeping well at night, 
uh, you know, you are very, very anxious about what is going on over here. But you've got, uh, you know, that, you've got the Magician card over here. So you're going to be able to manifest anything that you want. And you will make a brand new start at something new. The universe is bringing this to you. And it's got the Magician, the first two cards are Major Arcana. So although you're very stressed out and you not don't know what to do, you will be guided uh, towards... Um, the right move and it looks like an offer will come in from somebody around you some somebody you used to know it's going to be a good offer and it's going to pay you pretty well you've got the magician card appearing twice here so this is the magician so you are making a fresh start over here you can ma manifest anything you want uh, what you need will magically appear successful beginning so you are starting something brand new and the universe is bringing it to you and you know it's going to be something really fantastic something out of this world um, and you know it's going to employ all your skills so you are going to be very very busy soon you've got the page of Ariel so news coming in about that job an excellent opportunity will be offered to you scholarships or the pursuit of education time to get to work so maybe whatever this work is is going to involve education or teaching or you may even um, undertake some further education as well which is attached to the job but you're definitely going to be getting some news about that job pretty soon with that uh, page of Ariel and solutions are going to come uh, come to you success that comes from objective compromise self-control and patience forgive and healing energy so uh, it looks like um, solutions are coming in you will use all your skills and talents and you have what it takes in order to function in this particular new job um, and whatever you are worried about try not to be too worried about it because it seems like the universe is now stepping in for you and it's about to change the way things are going but you will have to leave this old situation behind and move on and don't be too disheartened about leaving it behind it doesn't look like it was very very good anyway uh, it doesn't seem like everybody was on your on your side. Whatever comes in, money is going to be coming in. You can see this hand giving somebody giving you and you receiving. So you will get a job offer that comes in, um, and it will and you get news about it pretty soon. And it's going to be something that you've been waiting for. Uh, the magician is your card. Make sure you're communicating very clearly, uh, and you're going to be very very busy. It might be even that you'll be traveling quite a bit as well with that magician card. So I hope that this reading has resonated with you. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, leave me some comments if it has. And thank you so much for watching. Take care now. Goodbye.